Do you know how to do cursive writing? Cursive writing. This kind of writing is called cursive writing. Do you know how to do it? This kind of writing is different from normal writing in that in cursive writing, the pen or pencil doesn't leave the page. It doesn't leave the page until after the word is finished. It doesn't leave the page until after you finished writing the word. For example, um, let's write the word winter. Winter, okay? It would go like this. Winter. Then, after I'm finished the word, I go back and dot the I and cross the T. I dot the I and cross the T. Do you know how to write like this in cursive? You know, I think most native English speakers don't even know how to write like this. I'm not sure, but I think most native English speakers don't even know how to write like this. Actually, a few weeks ago, I was listening to the radio in my car in Calgary, and the person on the radio was talking about how kids these days don't even know how to write. Don't even know how to write. Actually, the, the person was saying there was a kid who didn't even know how to write his own name. <laughs> didn't even know how to write his own name. You know, and they were talking about how smartphones have replaced writing, right? So kids these days are just, you know, texting away on their smartphones and they never actually write. So, you know, I guess technology has largely replaced the need to write, but I think it's still a great skill to have. I think it's a, it's a nice, it's a nice thing to, to know how to do. So if you want to learn how to write cursive like this, I made a little book just for you, just for you as a present. Now to get my book, uh, just go to my website, metv.cool, metv.cool, and you can download my book uh, on the website. It's free, free just for you, and uh, and then you can you can put it on your iPad if you have an iPad with a with an Apple pencil. You can uh, use that to practice, or you can print out the the PDF and practice with a, a normal pencil. Okay, so you have you have two options to practice. Okay, so let's take a look at my book here. Okay, so here's my book. Cursive writing, okay? Then if we scroll down a page, you'll see practice writing uppercase and lowercase letters, okay? So the first few pages are just practicing writing the letters, the uppercase and lowercase letters. Then uh, after a few pages, you will see practice writing short paragraphs. Practice writing short paragraphs, okay? So I have three paragraphs here that I've made for you to, to practice. So you just, you just trace the letters. You trace the words, right? And I think in just, you know, a short while, you will get the hang of writing cursive. It's not that hard. It's easy. You just need to, you just need to practice a little bit, okay? So let's take a look at the the first paragraph here. I like Mark. He is nice. He is my best friend. I want to buy him a nice Christmas present. Then if you scroll down a page, you'll see another paragraph, but it has smaller font. It has a smaller text size, so you can practice writing, and it's a longer paragraph. And then if you scroll down another page, you'll see an even bigger paragraph with even smaller font, okay? So it'll be good practice for you to start. Start big and then go smaller and smaller and smaller. I think you'll get the hang of it 
really quickly. Anyway, I hope you enjoy this book. I hope you have a happy day of cursive writing, and I will see you over in the next episode of Mad English TV. Take care.